What is going on Crypto Fiends? Thank you as always for tuning to the channel. Today we have some breaking news for you guys as it does appear that a mass Twitter hack is going on for crypto Twitter accounts. Now this sounds absolutely crazy, but over the past hour, over 25 different major cryptocurrency exchanges, CEOs, and popular figures in the cryptocurrency space have been hacked, and they all have been tweeting out um, a link to a obvious Bitcoin scam. Uh, now, the first one occurred at 3.13 p.m. by Binance.com, stating that we have partnered with Crypto for Health and are giving back 5,000 Bitcoin to the community. And of course, they also have a link to the website. Now, if you check out the link, it's a traditional cryptocurrency scam. You send them Bitcoin and they send you double back. It's obvious and unfortunately, some have fallen into the trap. Now, at first, I personally thought that it was just Binance Twitter account that got hacked. But then the CEO of Binance also got hacked. So I thought, OK, maybe it's a coincidence. But then we had other exchanges like Gemini Exchange, KuCoin, Coinbase, all being hacked and stating the same exact thing, posting the same exact link. We also had prominent CEOs like Arthur Hayes, the CEO of BitMEX. We also had the CEO of the Tron Foundation, Justin Sun. And of course, we had the infamous Bitcoin Twitter account being hacked as well. Now, we haven't gotten a direct statement from Twitter yet as to what's going on, but I feel like Andreas Antonopoulos said it best. Uh, he thinks that the Twitter API posting service was compromised and is being used to send out the fake giveaways. If this is compromised, that allows anyone to pretty much have a backdoor to all of the usernames and all of the passwords for those accounts, allowing them to simply put out any tweet that they'd like. Now, he does think that Twitter is not directly compromised, but he thinks it's a secondary social media posting service uh, that is popular and used by multiple companies. They often have weaker security and limited two-factor authenticator options, but full access to the Twitter API granted by the user. Um, so that is definitely possible. Now, don't get me wrong, Twitter could still be compromised. Again, we don't know just yet, um, but I feel like if Twitter was directly compromised, uh, why would this individual go after crypto accounts? Now, don't get me wrong, it's pretty obvious what their goal is here uh, to do is to get as much Bitcoin from this scam as possible. But if you had access to the Twitter API, you could go on Donald Trump's Twitter account and tweet out anything you'd like and really cause some chaos. Um, so as of now, it does appear that this is coming from a smaller social media company that has access to the Twitter API, but again, we won't know uh, until further notice. And as of right now, uh, we have a little over half a Bitcoin sent to this account. So all of this struggle, all of the risk of possibly possibly being caught for simply half of, of a Bitcoin is pretty crazy to me. Um, if you guys are interested in checking out the link um, to the Bitcoin address that is doing the scam, I will leave it linked down below. It is completely safe, by the way. You can click on that link um, and just look at the Bitcoin address, see which wallets are sending uh, to the address and how much money. It's, uh, it's unfortunate that people fall into these sort of scams because it's kind of obvious. But, you know, there are a lot of beginners out there that don't fully understand the space and they see a good opportunity and unfortunately they fall for it. Um, so yeah, as of right now, we have about 0.65 Bitcoin sent to the account and we will have to see uh, if this number increases as uh, more Twitter accounts may be compromised uh, within the next hour or so. I'm sure Twitter has it uh, uh, handled by now, but we will just have to see. Thank you guys, as always, for tuning into the channel. Uh, I know we have been a little bit stagnant on the videos lately. Uh, as you can see, I finally got the new studio up and running and I'm all settled into my new place. Um, so we will begin to have more videos pumped out onto the channel. I'm looking to do about four videos per week um, to give myself a little uh, room in between so I don't burn out or anything uh, but let me know down below what type of content you guys would like to see on the channel because as always I am catering to you the audience and thank you as always for supporting the content 
So if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join on in for quality content like this in the future. Thank you as always for watching and I will catch you in the next.